I really think you're an amazing woman, Trisha. I want you to be my baby mama. <laughs> Please make sweet, sweet sim babies with me for my baby room. <laughs> hey everyone, it's Deligracy here, obviously, and welcome to a brand new challenge video. Today is a very special video because I have a guest on the channel. Tiff is here, also known as I has Cupquake. How are you? Hi. Hello. <laughs> All the way from the USA. Yes. I'm so excited we're collabing. Me too. This has been in the works for months now. Finally, Tiff and I kind of merged our ideas and came up with the Sims <laughs> 4 Blind Matchmaker Challenge. It's a little bit confusing. It's taken a while for us to get our heads around it. Basically, I have made a Sim, Jasper Keys, right here. This is my Sim. And he is looking for the one. Tiff is going to make a blind date for Jasper using the random genetics challenge. Then we're gonna take Jasper on his dream date. Look yeah. at him. Oh my goodness. He's so cute. I thought he was rather attractive. I agree, um, I must agree. At the same time, we're also going to be making a blind date for Tip Sim. So if you guys want to see how that blind date goes down, then you can jump over to her channel. I'll link it in the description down below. But first of all, I'll introduce you to Jasper. This is him. He's very cute, but he just hasn't found the one yet. He's been searching for a little while. He aspires to find his soulmate. He's a bit romantic. He's a bit of a bro. Nothing wrong with being a bro. And then he loves the outdoors. He's so cute. I know. I think ideally he'd love to have someone to maybe go hiking with or Yeah, um, that's what I was like thinking. That. Like someone who's really active or something. Yeah. Basically with the traits, we're only allowed to pick one um, that is a positive trait. The next one has to be a negative trait. And the last one is a random trait. That's a restriction. And then of course, like I said mm -hmm. earlier, it's going to be like the random genetics challenge. We'll come back after creating a date for you Tiff and then we will meet our blind date that you've created for us. I'm excited. All right <laughs> let's do this. It's gonna be fun. All right you guys so now we are going to be making a blind date for Tiff Sim while she makes a blind date for our Sim. Let's get started. Okay so first of all we'll randomize his name three times. One, two, three. Hector, one, two, three. Sanderson. And then in terms of aspiration, we're allowed to pick his aspiration. You know, why don't we get someone who wants to find their soulmate? That's always a nice thing. And I think a sim that is flirty is definitely going to assist Tiff in their date. So let's help her out a little bit and make a romantic. Now we have to pick one bad trait. Let's make him a little bit erratic. He's a little bit crazy. <laughs> And then we have to do a random trait. So I'm going to just kind of close my eyes. It's always kind of hard. What do we get? He's a perfectionist. Okay, so it's an erratic perfectionist who is romantic. Okay, Hector, interesting fellow. All right, now in terms of the face, let's randomize it. So we go one, two, three. Oh, he's cute so far. One, two, three. I mean, this could potentially look a little bit like Prince Charming. One, two, three, please be good. Oh gosh, I don't like this at all. One, two, three. One, two, three. Nose, one, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, he's got beautiful high cheekbones. One, two, three. Oh, nice. He's actually not looking too bad. Like he's got some nice, pillowy lips. Uh, and then this is kind of the make or break the face. The chin can go so wrong or it can go so right. Let's just see. I'm a bit nervous about this one. One, two, three. Oh, we got a bad chin. We got the bad chin. And ears, one, two, three. Oh God, he got the big Dumbo ears. He'd be a really cute old man. I think we should give her an old man. I mean, why not? <gasps> Hector the cowboy, yes. So let's give him like a bit of a cowboy outfit, which means he'll definitely need some cowboy shoes. I really want them to stand out. So I'm gonna go with the lighter color. What do cowboys wear? I don't even know. Okay, we'll randomize the body. One, two, three. Oh, good grief. Hector is, <laughs> Hector is a big boy. 
right, here's some nice jeans tucked into his little cowboy boots. I think he's looking pretty damn fine, if you ask me. I would totally go there. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wouldn't. I think the glasses were a little bit too nerdy. Let's maybe go with these. These ones are a little cooler. And we'll go with purple because we know Tiff loves purple. Um, So we need to add a little bit of purple in there for her. He is looking mighty fine. Huh. I just thought we That's don't know what way. kind of date Tiff is going to take them on. Mm -hmm. So let's make sure that he has some other <sighs> forms of clothing. Two thousand years later. All right, you guys, I've gone ahead and given him some other outfits as well. So obviously we have the everyday wear, which is his nice muscle wife beater singlet, as we call them, um, with his iconic cowboy hat and cowboy boots, which he never takes off except to go swimming. So for formal wear, he's got his boots, a beautiful, beautiful crusty brown suit to match his hat perfectly, very dapper. And then we have this gorgeous look for his active wear. He likes to work out in his iconic denim, blue denim, um, singlet, showing off those beautiful old man pecs. Mm. And then the cowboy boots and hat again. He's a cowboy in the bedroom as well, you guys. Oof. I'm going to now upload Hector to the gallery. And if you would like to see Tiff's reaction of what she thinks about Hector and to see how his date goes, do click the link in the description down below to head over to Tiff's channel. If you guys wanna see the blind date that we get, keep on watching. All right, you guys, welcome back. I have sent Tiff our sim that we've just made for her blind date, but now we are going to see who our blind date is. I am nervous. <laughs> I am excited. I think I got pretty lucky. Really? I feel like yeah. I'm about to go on a date. Like I'm nervous <laughs> for Jasper. <laughs> All right. You got the butterflies? Yeah, I've got the butterflies. <laughs> All right, you guys. So we are here in Oasis Springs. This is where our Sim lives. And he has this cute little house that I just got off the gallery. And our blind date has walked in the door. She's looking very <laughs> confident. <laughs> Checking out, uh, checking out his, his digs. And look at this, you guys. She's gone straight into the future kid's room. He wants a family so badly. That is not creepy at all. Not creepy at all. He has a whole little bassinet set up. Look, he's got some random kid shoes to put on the wall for decoration. <laughs> Creepy as. And look at this, they're reading books together. I mean, we are off to a great start. I'm thinking because he likes the outdoors, maybe he should take her out to Granite Falls for a little bit of hiking um, to see how she goes. What do you think? Yeah, I think anything active would be good. Now that we do have seasons in the game, it is spring, the season of love I decided to pick. And it's a sunny but cool day. So it's a perfect kind of day for them to go and get active. God, I feel so awkward for them. I can't believe she just, <laughs> like they both went straight to the kids room. It's like, he didn't want to muck around. He was like, this is what I want. This is what I want. What oh, in my no. future? It's a match made in heaven. Oh my gosh, they're talking. They're talking. He's like, it's a beautiful sunny day. Love is blossoming. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yes. uh oh. Seneca Belinda Grin. Oh, she's being mean. Is she. Oh. I think so, but he's handling it okay. He's a bro, so he's chill. He can deal with sass, maybe. <laughs> Yeah. I think, I think this is working. All right. Match made in heaven. Match made in heaven. Look, we're in the <laughs> <Yeah>. green. <laughs> oh, no. oh no, he's talking about his love heart. Um, oh no, oh, he was talking about his love heart um, boxes, which he actually is wearing um, as his underwear. Oh. <sighs> All right, well, let's go on a little bit of a vacay over to Granite Falls. We'll see if Trish yeah, no, likes the outdoors as well. Oh my day. gosh. Yep. Yeah. There she goes, showing off. Look at her showing off her booty, like it's right in, <laughs> in the view range. My gosh, Trish, calm down. <laughs> I think we'll rough it. Let's rough it on a campground. Oh yeah, um, you'll really get to know each other. True, you know, he's jumping right in to this date. He wants to get to know her uh, when she's feeling vulnerable in, in the bush. Um, <laughs> in the forest. <laughs> So oh, send home straight away. Let's um, apologize for uh, our nasty behavior. Oh, she wants to look at the stars? Oh, well, we'll apologize first. It's like, I'm so sorry for being rude. <laughs> 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 she should be apologizing. 
<laughs> oh, she just wants right? a burger and fries. Oh, she's, mm, she's hungry. <laughs> oh, he's feeling gloomy. Oh, well, let's give her a heartfelt compliment. Oh my God. You look like trash. <laughs> She's trash. Absolute trash. She's like, thanks. <laughs> I like how Trish is leading the way as well. She right. She looks like the leader, like she wears the pants. What is he doing? Let's maybe this just- This is a date, no third wheel. <laughs> I know, like, <laughs> what is that, Yusuf? Yusuf. Yusuf? We can ask about camping info, but I don't think we need that. What we do need though is a tent. Cause I think, um. Mm -hmm. I think Jasper here might want to go for the woohoo. You know, he might just want a baby. Whoa. I don't know where you would get the slightest idea. <laughs> that. All right, let's get him to go get some camping supplies. Over There's we go. There's nothing like woohoo while camping, though. It's the dirtiest, <laughs> dirtiest place. Oh my gosh. You know, he's all about that. Jasper loves that. So it's all good. Let's just maybe get a good old um, cooler, a pink camper chair for Trish. Do you think she'll like that? I think she likes that color. All right. So I think we've got everything we need. There we go. And where is, where's Trish? He's going to swoop. I know. He's going to swoop on. Don't on that girl is gonna swoop on her oh my god what is with him he's like do you want to go get coffee sometime <laughs> no <laughs> you want to move in together maybe okay quickly quickly jasper you're about to lose your lady all right let's get everything out so let's get the tent out um get trisha camper chair oh good he's got the fire going he's mm -hmm. <laughs> ready <laughs> um, invite to hang out. Let's get Trish to come over here and um, feel a bit of the love flame that is just lit. Oh, oh no. Oh, compliment her. Ooh, again. he's feeling flirty. <gasps> yes. <gasps> and you know what? The cozy campfire is helping that. So that's boosting flirty. Oh no, no, we lost the flirt. It's gone. Get to know her a little bit more. Do we confess an attraction this early? I mean, <laughs> it's too soon, right? Your call, your call. <laughs> should maybe we should get Trish to say, give him a little bit of something back. Ooh. I'm gonna go for the embrace. Oh, she's quite flirting. forward. She's a lady who knows what she wants. <gasps> now they have. Oh. Oh my gosh. Wow. And she's feeling. She's very focused. Focused, <laughs> she's like, focused to find love. Hold hands. This is going very well, by the way. Yeah. Oh, look, he's sweet. he's talking to her about the house. Oh. I already have the baby room set up. And she's like, I would yeah, love to stay at home and clean and bake cupcakes. <laughs> oh my God, first kiss already. Ooh, yes. I can't believe how successful <gasps> this is. There's a little pond here. A cute spot. Oh, this looks yeah. romantic. Oh, oh, it's so cute. Okay, let's get them to go here together. This is romantic. I wish this was my life. <laughs> right? It's way better than my first kiss. Oh, yes. <laughs> my, oh my gosh. My first kiss, I, I had braces. The guy no. <laughs> didn't, but he had big teeth. And so I remember we just like teeth clunked the whole time. <laughs> no, you did yes. not. Oh, God. And it was a dare. That's terrible. Come on, Trisha, be our baby mama. <laughs> <laughs> We're not rushing into this. They would at make all. beautiful babies. They would. Oh, look. Oh. Wow. Let's kiss her hands. Go for it, boy. Here we go. Here it goes. Moment of truth. Okay. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first kiss. Please don't oh. reject him. Please don't reject. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, here. Yay! Woohoo! <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Do you know how many times my Sims are being rejected trying that? <laughs> and really? And he runs away. <laughs> and then he runs away. <laughs> like, oh my God. <laughs> Come back, you've gotta, you gotta continue this date. I know. Okay, how are their needs? He has to seal the deal. I know. Well, Trish needs oh, to Oh, she's feeling flirty. Oh, she's still feeling flirty. Yeah. Okay. But we'll get her to tinkle quickly because we don't want her to wet Blaine. her pants. Oh, no. There's oh. no toilet here. We don't want any accidents <laughs> on our first date. No. not That would not be good. 
You, you know what I always find really strange is when people say they laugh so much that they pee. Are you one of yeah, those I've people? Never, no, no, I've never experienced. Are you one of those no, people? No, no. Those people? But I, Who out there is one of those people? people? Um, <laughs> let us know in the comments down below if you're one of those people. Let us know if you pee your pants <laughs> when you laugh. <laughs> because I feel like that's the only way you would wet yourself on a first date or if you were really nervous. Yeah. Okay. So. Or if you just really had to go. Oh. And then I think it's time for a little bit of a romantic dinner, and then maybe they can seal the baby deal um, with a bit wow. of luck on the first date. Like I don't know. We might not have a high enough relationship for a baby, but really, I think that's all that um, Jasper wants. So let's yeah. cook up a meal. It's so typical. Like she's mm -hmm. still swooning over the first kiss, feeling so romantic, and he's yeah. like already moved on. <laughs> oh. She needs to go kiss the chef. <gasps> yes, kiss, kiss the chef. The chef. Kiss the chef. <laughs> Wait, is she talking to the bear? Is she, oh my gosh. She's eating alone. Oh my, oh my gosh! No, this is so bad. <laughs> oh my gosh, Jasper. Oh, she's He's cooked up these hamburgers for her and she is just doesn't want anything to do with it. She's so sassy. She's like, I'm going to eat my beans. Oh, no, she's going to be gassy. <laughs> she is an independent woman. She doesn't care. She's like, I want to show you like this is who I is. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now they're having a meal together. Oh, my God. Look, what? Woo hoo. <gasps> in tent. I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh, she's already got it on her mind. Oh my God, wow. there is Trey for baby. No way. You have to. I have to. Okay, After I think. After dinner, you know, on a full tummy. Oh my gosh, <laughs> full of beans too. So she's gonna like go for a stinky <laughs> woohoo. Ew, in the tent. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> All right, All right. So she's, she's feeling flirty. So I'm actually right. going to <gasps> warm up with body heat. Warm up with Body. I actually have Ooh. never seen that interaction. <laughs> oh god, neither have I. Probably because there's no fire right now, but you know, that's what you gotta do in the wilderness. It's true. Oh, because it's cold because of seasons. Yeah. Oh, it's like body oh. heat. Apparently the best way to warm up is to have body heat with two naked people. So yeah. obviously they need to get in that tent it's naked. Just to stay warm, okay? Yes. No other reason. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so sweet. That is so cute. I want to try for this baby. Should we see if it works? Yeah. I mean, it's a pretty low relationship, though. It, there could be rejection. She's she's going for it. Let's um get him to. They have a lot of roses like packed into their pockets. <laughs> Confess the attraction. I really think you're an amazing woman, Trisha. I want you to be my baby mom. <laughs> Please make sweet, sweet sim babies with me for my baby room. <laughs> She's like, oh. He's like, I want to make a naked statue of you. Oh. Oh. oh my. Wow. He's like, let's take this what? to the tent. Oh. Oh. It is. Girl. Heat it. <laughs> It's happening. It is. Ha it is on. Oh, and she's saying, I'm so cold. Cuddle me. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's try for the baby. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my They're gosh. They're going. Are they going? Is, is this going to be rejection? I'm so nervous. Simba. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Oh, oh, my gosh. Oh, like, yes. my gosh. This is wow. amazingly successful. <gasps> Oh, and what a uh, happy ending. What a literally <laughs> happy ending wow. right there. Oh my wow. gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so beautiful. Do you ever feel awkward watching your Sims woohoo? I do. I do. We give <laughs> them it's privacy. double awkward when there's someone in the call with you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, and they lived happily ever after. That is beautiful. I guess we should see if it was successful and see if she's pregnant. Um. <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh, we should do oh my like. Goodness. Oh wow, that they are having fun. It's looking very uh, yeah. hot in there. <laughs> Ooh, sparks are flying. Yay. Oh, they're feeling so good about it as well. Oh. 
so cute. That's a beautiful wow. thing. Wow. The relationship went way high though. Whoa, look at that. that. I mean, they barely know each other. <laughs> Yet they tried yeah. for a baby. Let's just see. <laughs> oh, I don't think she can check to see if she's pregnant in here. I don't think we can do it there. Um, maybe we should. He's already sleeping. <laughs> He's already sleeping. <laughs> maybe we should end the vacation and go home and see if she's pregnant. Um, because I I'm yeah. curious now. And then we could have like a five <laughs> years later segment. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Where are they now? And where are they now? <laughs> I love it. All right, we're back at the house. Let's see if this was successful. Oh my God, he even has a baby potty. <laughs> what? He's prepared. Okay, take the pregnancy. He's ready. Test. He is so ready. He just wanted to woohoo and try for a baby. <gasps> oh, yay! Oh my God. Yay! And Look at her. She's already showing. Oh my God. Oh, wow. Well, that wow. happened so quickly. She's yep. telling him the good news. Yeah, oh, he is happy. Is he happy? <laughs> He's like, yay! <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys, wow. this just goes to show that happy endings can be fast and passionate. And as long as you're proud and passionate about something and you go and get it it can happen very quickly i think this was a successful mm -hmm. very successful blind date blind matchmaker day. well you guys yeah i guess we will finish this here and thanks um tiff for creating our one and only true love um very exciting <laughs> baby mama. our baby mama yeah. and uh i'm so excited <laughs> to see what you think about blind dates so if you guys want to check it out and see how our blind date goes on Tiff's channel. Click the link in the description down below and we'll see you over there. And as always, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon. So, so.